Today we're here with our team in the south of Israel, in the small community of Ibim, and we're here to express our support and solidarity with the peoples along the border. As you know, they've been experiencing rocket attacks and incendiary balloons that have caused fires throughout the region. It's been our opportunity and pleasure to provide essential firefighting equipment. And today we want to make sure that they have the most basic things that are needed to protect them while they're out in these missions of fighting fires. And so we're going to be providing them with firefighting pants and boots so that they can do their job more effectively. And we want to make sure that they know that Christians around the world are thinking of them and are supporting them. The equipment that we have here that is uh, donated by the ICEJ, pants so that your pants don't burn off your legs, <laughs> boots so that your feet are protected and that uh, you can continue to walk on this, uh, walk on this ground and masks so that you can breathe safely, which will be delivered next week. <laughs> These gifts from our friends at the Christian Embassy are tangible statements of their love to the nation of Israel. This, the bell part of the shelter weighs 10 metric tons, which is about 22,000 pounds. And the, this part here is called the Muvua, which is a passageway that weighs five metric tons, around 11 and a half thousand pounds. And um, the idea is, is, is that, first of all, these are transportable, they're movable. Shelters, if necessary, can be moved to another location. So that means that they're really useful if the situation changes and it's a decision to literally, that's why we leave the hook up there on the top of the bell. And also here are the eyes that also can be moved. But uh, basically, this, uh, this is a shelter that really saves lives. Um, the reason why there's no door on this particular one is there's not enough time to open and close the door. You have seconds from the time that the siren goes off to get in here. Therefore, we have a passageway. Once you clear the passageway, you're in the safe area. And that's what this does. So thank you very, very much. firefighting equipment and this shelter which you see here which is to protect medical teams along the border was all made possible because of your support and if you haven't had the chance to partner with us go to icej.org slash crisis and we thank you for your generous giving ICEJ.